So this is the 2021 Ford Bronco Sport, which is not to be confused with the larger brother, the Bronco, which hasn't arrived yet. But there's something pretty amazing about this so-called baby Bronco because it has almost all of the attributes of the larger Bronco while keeping the price reasonable. It's easy to confuse this Bronco Sport with the larger Bronco because many of the design themes are carried over to this particular model but um, I'm going to point out seven reasons why perhaps the Bronco Sport might be the better choice for many people compared to the larger and the more expensive Bronco. As an automotive engineer I have different perspectives about cars and trucks that I drive and I'm going to go through all seven reasons why the Bronco Sport may be a better choice for most of you but first, let me walk you through some basic backgrounds of this new Bronco Sport. The most important thing to notice about the Bronco Sport is that this one is actually based on the car body. More specifically, what we call unitized body or monocoque body. And so it doesn't have a separate frame. Now, it doesn't mean you cannot go off-roading if the body is not separated from an actual frame. But there is a difference in ride and quality. And there's a difference in the way that um, the SUV feels on the road when it's a unitized body versus body on frame trucks so the Bronco Sport is based on the Ford Escape which has unitized body versus the Bronco which is based on the next generation Ford Ranger and therefore that one has a complete body on frame design and it has a real ladder frame underneath so that's the biggest difference between the Bronco Sport and Bronco but there's other also key differences the engine lineup is quite different between the Bronco Sport and the Bronco as well. Most of the Bronco Sport is equipped with a 1.5 liter, 181 horsepower, three cylinder turbocharged engine made it to an eight speed automatic. The top of the line Badlands though have a two liter, 250 horsepower, four cylinder, non-turbo engine now many of you guys might wonder though how could a three-cylinder turbo engine be any good but the three-cylinder turbo is actually quite a fantastic engine with lots of power and torque and you would never know it's a three-cylinder engine when you're driving this bronco sport and while we have kind of fascination with the larger engines here in north america the rest of the world have been living with and have been very happy with smaller three-cylinder turbocharged engines in many of the cars in different brands so nothing to be concerned about the fact that it has a smaller engine and the fact that this particular Outer Banks is a very uh, street friendly and road friendly model makes this particular Bronco Sport a true joy to drive around town competing with a Jeep Renegade and the upcoming Ford Maverick perhaps even this uh, Bronco Sport carves out a niche in many ways because of the unique design and the way the entire car looks and feels. I can almost call this kind of a baby Land Rover with a high roof line and a rugged go anywhere look and feel. So I really like the whole concept of this uh, Ford Bronco Sport which is taking what's good about unitized body and making it more off-road friendly. Because Bronco Sport is based on the Ford Escape, some people might say that this is not a true off-road capable vehicle, much like the larger Bronco. But surprisingly, this Bronco Sport is actually quite good on a variety of different roads, even some really harsh condition and some really tough roads. As a result, I can actually recommend this Bronco Sport even over the larger Bronco for many applications. At the end of the day, it may come down to a personal choice when it comes to choosing between the Bronco Sport and the larger Bronco. But I actually think there are a number of advantages in buying the Bronco Sport versus the larger Bronco. So let me tell you seven reasons why I actually think the Bronco Sport could be a better choice for you compared to the more expensive Bronco that's yet to arrive. 
The first reason why the Bronco Sport could be a better buy for some of you is the fact that it is available right now. You can walk into Ford dealership and while there's a huge demand for this car, you can go ahead and likely get one pretty quickly compared to uh, the larger Bronco, which has a huge waiting list. In fact, I have two deposits on the larger Bronco and I might be able to get one this year, but generally speaking, there's a long waiting list. So at least with the Bronco Sport, you have a pretty good chance of getting one in a very short time. Whereas if you haven't placed a reservation yet on the other Bronco, it could be quite a while before you can can get your hands on one. So that was the first reason. It's simply an easier access to this model. The second reason why the Bronco Sport could be the better SUV for you is the fact that it is smaller and therefore easier to maneuver around town and definitely easier to park. Now there isn't a huge difference in size if you compare the Bronco Sport, this is the four-door only version, to the two-door version of the larger Bronco. But if you compare Apple to Apple, then you'll be comparing this one to the four-door Bronco. And in that case, the Sport version is definitely quite a bit smaller. So if you are the type of person who are using the SUV or crossover mostly for uh, within town and city driving, then the Bronco Sport is definitely an easier car to manage. With a wheelbase of 105 inches and the overall length of about 172 inches, again, the Bronco Sport is definitely slightly smaller than the Bronco two-door and quite a bit smaller than the larger Bronco four-door. So it's just generally speaking, uh, as I was driving this all over the place here in Vancouver, I found it to be pretty easy to maneuver and park and no problem squeezing into some tight spaces in underground parking. So that's another reason why the Bronco Sport could be a better choice for you. The third reason why the Bronco Sport is a good choice is the fact that it is based on the Ford Escape, is based on a unitized body, so it drives more like a car than a truck. Compared to the um, Big Brother Bronco, that is definitely a body on the frame, truck-based design, and so that one will probably drive a bit more truck-like. Now, some people like the truck feel, and therefore the Bronco would be a better choice for them. But if you're a type of person who really likes a smooth ride, a predictable handling, and something that feels more like a car than a truck, then the Bronco Sport is definitely a better choice. Uh, the Bronco Sport, in fact, drives quite remarkably well. And I'll take you on a drive right now and talk about the driving experience. Because the Bronco Sport is based on the Ford Escape, which is based on a unitized car body, there's a big advantage to that. And that is the Bronco Sport will feel more like a car than the Bronco. So that means that it will drive smoother, more refined, uh, it will be uh, quieter, and the uh, handling will be more predictable and perhaps more balanced. Now, none of us have actually driven the, the larger Bronco yet that hasn't been available for us to drive. So it's a little hard to say, but based on everything that we already know about the larger Bronco, we know that vehicle will be more rugged, but also perhaps harsher in terms of ride and you'll feel a little bit more unpredictable. So there is a, an advantage in buying the Bronco Sport for most of us who do not need to go a lot of off-roading. So uh, if you were to look at the steering feel, the braking, the acceleration, the ride, the comfort and the quietness, the Bronco Sport is really fantastic and uh, yet Ford was able to dial in a bit of an off-road feel and what I mean by that is that the steering feel is somewhat more truck-like. They made it a little bit heavier than the Ford Escape. It has a bit of a more of a rugged feel and I feel a bit more connected to the road than Ford Escape or other SUV in this class. So they did refine and calibrate the, um, the feel of of the car so that it does feel a bit more truck-like while retaining most of what makes a uh, unitized body a better car. So here um, on the normal driving as I'm doing right now, it's, uh, it's very predictable, it's uh, very quiet. Uh, even with a three-cylinder turbo engine being somewhat smaller than what you might want, it's actually totally fine and the braking is solid, it feels good, and uh, most of all the ride is very comfortable. 
Because the Bronco Sport is a smaller and lighter model compared to the larger Bronco, the fourth reason why the Bronco Sport is also a very good choice is because it will likely give you a better fuel efficiency. Now, we don't have all the official numbers yet for both models, but there's no doubt that the smaller engine and the lighter body will give you a longer range and a better fuel economy for the Bronco Sport. So if you're a type of person who are concerned about that, then the Bronco Sport has another advantage advantage over the Bronco. The fifth and very important and substantial reason for buying the Bronco Sport is the fact that it's going to be cheaper than the Bronco. Now, if you were to compare just the base model of the Bronco Sport to Bronco, there isn't as much price difference as you think, but if you equip it the similar fashion and compare four door to four door, then there is a very substantial difference as much as several thousand dollars or more. And the Bronco has many other optional features that are not available on the Bronco Sport. So as you keep adding options that one gets more and more expensive so there is a big advantage in buying the bronco sport right now simply because it's a more affordable car in the long run though which model would retain the value better that's a bit harder to say because the bronco is in such a big demand the larger bronco i mean so that one might have a better resale value but there's no question that the bronco sport this one is also in good demand and people seem to love the design so i think I think both will have very similar resale value and so ultimately the buying price will be a very important criteria and the Bronco Sport definitely will save you several thousand dollars over the Bronco. So here I'm talking about the seven reasons why the Bronco Sport could very well be a better choice for some of you compared to the Bronco and the sixth reason is the fact that the Bronco Sport is perhaps a better packaging because on the larger Bronco you get things like a removable roof and even the door can be removed uh, and so forth uh, but it's also larger and higher off the ground so in the case of Bronco Sport because it's based on the Ford Escape and because it's more like a car it's uh, quieter uh, easier to pa maneuver and also easier to get in and out so it's a low off the ground it's just a it's just a step away into the model here. And the seating comfort and everything else is actually just like a Ford Escape. And so I find it to be very comfortable compared to perhaps a larger Bronco, which could be a little bit more rugged, but it could also be noisier and maybe not as comfortable. Overall, the over packaging of the Bronco Sport is likely a little bit more user-friendly. It's gonna be easier to get in and out, and the trunk and so forth is very easy to open and manage. So I can either open just the top here or the entire um, hatch. It's very light. I find this to be really light. It's not high off the ground. And I really like this having two shelf system here where you can just put this down and you get a hard, hard shell. Now, I wish this was rubberized like it is here. There, there's a mat here that makes it non-slippery. This one is slippery, but still, I love this design and the fact that I can load things up. There's even a built-in ruler here as well and all kinds of interesting feature you can fold down the seats obviously i've got one sided folded and i think just the overall whole package of the bronco sport is actually quite quite ideal and very suited for city dwellers and those people who don't really need a true off-roader the seventh and the final reason why the Bronco Sport could be a great buy is somewhat personal in nature, and that is the design of the Bronco Sport. Some people really like the Bronco Sport design and they think it's a little bit more subdued and modernized compared to the rugged look of the Bronco. In fact, I've got nothing but amazing praise from people who have walked beside this Bronco Sport or just passing by and asking if this is the Bronco that everyone is talking about. Now, there's no doubt the larger Bronco has more of a rugged and off-road look. And I do actually prefer that design versus the Bronco Sport. But there's something kind of cute and very cool about the Bronco Sport design that is unique and it has its own strength. So while I cannot say that this is a true advantage over the Bronco, not everyone likes the look and feel of a more rugged and truck-like Bronco. And some people just like this kind of a modernized feel. So if you are one of those people who really like the design and the look and feel of this Bronco Sport, then this is the car and SUV for you. So I just gave you seven reasons why the Bronco Sport 
could be a better buy for you compared to a larger and more expensive Bronco, but it may come down to somewhat of a personal choice. But just keep in mind the Bronco and the Bronco Sport is two very distinct models because the Bronco is based on the truck frame. It's going to be a lot more off-road capable compared to the Ford Escape based Bronco Sport which is designed on a unitized body and therefore more car-like. The two can't be more different other than some similar design themes. So please go and maybe drive the Bronco Sport and when the Bronco comes out, you can compare the two and see which one you like. Just keep in mind that the larger Bronco is really hard to get hold of. You're gonna have to wait a year or longer to get it. Whereas the Bronco Sport is available right now and you can go and buy it. So if you're a type of person who just can't wait and those seven reasons I gave you is a good enough of factors, then the Bronco Sport would be a really good purchase for you. Now this could be a somewhat controversial discussion because a lot of people may not consider Bronco Sport to be a true off-road capable vehicle because it's not based on a truck frame. And on top of that, the Bronco Sport is built in Mexico while the Bronco is built in the US. So there are a number of reasons why you still may want to buy the larger Bronco and there's no question those people will not consider Bronco Sport. But if you're the type of person who are shopping for a compact to mid-size SUV and always wanted something a little bit more rugged and something unique in terms of design and feel and you don't really need the larger and more capable Bronco, well this could be a really really cool choice for you because if you were to look at other choices in the market, you end up with things like a RAV4, um, Nissan Rogue and of course the Jeep Renegade but many of those just do not look cool enough whereas the Bronco Sport is truly unique in design and it has many of the design elements from the larger Bronco. So I would not hesitate to buy the Bronco Sport over the Bronco because you're going to save some money and also save some gas. Overall, the Bronco Sport is a great purchase, one that you can enjoy right now and not have to wait for the larger Bronco. I take my hats off to Ford who were very clever and smart enough to come up with the whole idea of a Bronco. In fact, some dealership is going to have a Bronco themed standalone showroom designed for people who really like the Bronco brand. So the Bronco themed sub-brand will continue to grow and I just can't wait to see what else Ford has up his sleeve. It's a really exciting time for Ford, a really exciting time for those people who were waiting for years for the Bronco to come back. And the Bronco Sport represent one of the best buys out there because it combines unique character with some amazing features and really, really good overall performance.